what is going on you guys welcome back to another video and to the channel so for this video i'm going to be doing a tiny little modification to my bmw f80 m3 and that is going to be changing out the halogen bulbs that are functioning as my reverse lights for led bulbs now, as you guys know, this is a 2018 F80 M3, and you would have thought by that year, 2018, the reverse lights would have just came with LED bulbs from factory. But no, this car came with just standard halogen bulbs. Now, for me personally, I don't really like the look of halogen bulbs. I like the look of LED bulbs. They just look cooler, brighter, more modern, and plus, all the other lighting functions on this car are LED so it would just go better with all the other lighting functions on the car so yeah that's why i'm doing it but i know this is a very small little detail that most people probably wouldn't notice but for me i noticed it so that's why i want to do it and i'm going to show you guys how to do it like usual i'm sure there's already tons of videos on how to do this on youtube already but it won't hurt to add another one and plus i like to document everything i do to my cars on the channel of course but uh, anyway that's enough yapping for me so let's get into the important stuff so this is one of the led bulbs that i'm going to be installing on the car and i got these from amazon like almost a year ago i think for like 17 dollars total because I was actually going to install these on the clear lens LCI taillights that I had on my F30, if you guys remember that last year. But as you guys know, I ended up selling that car for this car. So yeah, I never got around to installing these. So now I'm going to install them on this car. So as you guys can see, the reverse light is in this part of the taillight in this little clear section here, obviously. So I would need to get behind the taillight, this piece here. And to get behind the taillight, I just simply need to remove this whole piece here. And it's just held in by eight of these little plastic screws here. You can see there's four right there, two down there, and then two in the middle here in these little holes here on each side right here and then there are also two regular screws right here that I'm gonna have to remove. To remove all of those I'm just gonna be using a simple screwdriver here. So to remove these plastic screws here you just simply unscrew it like normal and then eventually it'll hit a point where it stops spinning just like that and then I'll just simply use a flathead screwdriver to pry out the whole piece. There we go, and just simply pulled it out after a certain point. So now I'll do the same thing for the other seven plastic screws. Next, I'm gonna have to remove both of these plastic pieces here. So this one and then the one on the other side. It's just held on by these two clips on the back side here. Just simply unclip them. So now I should be able to remove this whole piece or at least move it down. So now I have access to the back of the taillight and the reverse light bulb is actually inside this piece here. So I should just be able to pull this out. There we go, as you can see, just simply pull it out and there we have the halogen bulb that is acting as the reverse light. Now to remove the halogen bulb itself, you just simply press down and then turn it counterclockwise and then it'll pop out just like that. So now comparing the LED bulb with the halogen bulb, you guys can see it has the same H21W bulb socket, so it will fit exactly the same way. So let's go ahead and install the LED bulb. There we go, just like that. Now I'll go ahead and reinstall the whole piece. Oh, 
There we go. Here I'm doing the other side. Now this side actually came out separately from this little outer plastic piece here. So I guess that makes it a little bit easier. Go ahead and remove the halogen bulb. And now I'll install the LED bulb. So now that both of the LED bulbs are in, before I put all of this back together, let's go ahead and test them by putting the car in reverse to make sure they work. All right, so they appear to be working properly. So now I'll go ahead and reinstall everything. So I don't know about you guys, but these LED bulbs made the reverse lights look 10 times better. Again, I know this is a very small little modification that like nobody is going to notice but myself. Regardless, I'm sure there's some of you out there that maybe feel the same way about having, you know, LED reverse lights over halogen reverse lights. So now moving away from the LED reverse lights and just talking about the car in general. Now I'm sure some of you guys are wondering when am I gonna start doing more significant, more exciting modifications to the car? Because at this point, four months in, I've only really done the lowering springs as like a significant modification. Nothing else, I've just been doing little things like the one in this video. For me, I'm just taking it slow and just enjoying the car as it is in its stock form because I know once I start adding more significant modifications to the car, some things that I like that the car has right now in its stock form will be sacrificed. So I'm just kind of taking my time so I don't have to worry about all that stuff, you know, right off the bat. I've only had this car for four months and you know, I don't want to just rush into everything all at once. I am planning to have this car for a very long time, so there's plenty of time for me to add modifications to the car. I still have a lot of things that I do want to add to the car and I will get there eventually. Just right now, I'm just taking my time. On top of that, I've also been busy outside of doing this because YouTube isn't my full-time thing. It's just more of like a hobby, part-time thing. So I don't have that much extra time to film videos and anytime I want to install a part, I want to do videos so as a result i just haven't added anything to the car because i can't do a video on it so yeah you guys are just gonna have to be patient um i will get there but uh yeah anyway i think that's gonna do it for this video i will link the led bulbs that i got from amazon if you guys want to check these out and use them as reverse lights on your f80 or they also work on the f30 and i think the f32 and maybe even the f22 um, but as long as it's the h21w bulb socket it can fit so yeah, I'll leave that link in the description of this video if you guys want to check those out. But uh, yeah, anyway, thank you guys for watching. As always, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more content if you liked what you saw. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next video.